What's up guys, welcome back to my second channel. Today I have another blooper video for you guys, and then it's followed up by a tour video. Showing what it's like before one of the dates. So yeah, enjoy the video. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> he looks so much like John Stamos. He looks like himself all the fucking time. <laughs> it sucks. Well, looks like they didn't have to tear this house down, Josh. Yeah, well, when you have an asshole sister who basically blows up the fucking house. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Michelle, come out! <laughs> I didn't record it because I was nervous. You did it! I had my camera on. I was recording and a security guy comes up. He's like, anybody here an employee? And I go, it's John Stamos. And he goes, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Do you care about Josh at all? No. no. Is he doing his whole, he doesn't care about me, bit. Oh, he did it. He did it. Like six day we were just on Hollywood Boulevard, and Jason showed someone his nipple piercing, and the guy started chasing him, trying to touch his titty. <laughs> I caught it late, but this is the footage. Michelle don't even know my government, huh? Shorty taking like a supplement, huh? We ain't losing, let me spit it now, because she got it now, because she's loving it, girl. That's What's going on? What happened? You don't want me to touch his nipple. Oh, don't touch his nipple. Uh -oh. He just, just got no, it no, pierced. No, 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 no. What's that? Did you see that? Yeah. He came at me twice. What the fuck? I don't know. He's trying to touch your nipple. He touched it twice. He grabbed it twice. It fucking hurt. He does like videos online where I think he does like crazy stuff like that. Oh, that's his thing? Yeah. Oh, well, he's real good at his job, man. That's crazy. How would you say the trip is going so far? I hate this. I hate all this. I didn't know Jason was coming. That's what threw me off. He's your co-host. Oh, shit, yeah. <laughs> I didn't know you were going to be such a fucking dick. Or else I wouldn't have... Oh, no, my nipple. My nipple. No. <laughs> uh, Jason's the only only one that's ever died standing up. <laughs> Can we go around the room and be honest for a this second? This isn't a room, it's a car. Did you get that? <laughs> I just want to say this to David. David, you're one of my greatest friends. And, you know, you're hanging- I filmed a really nice bit with Scott. I don't know if you want to keep it in or not. No? No. Did you already put it in? We'll have to just take the blowback on that one. Okay. <laughs> <sighs> Okay, that was me getting out of the car. Did you guys all see that? That's the kind of dedication I have. Jason just left the room saying, I'm gonna go say hi to Heath. And he's <laughs> right there. I, I literally, I walked over, I was like, hey Jason. Like he just had his head right there and he just didn't acknowledge me and I was like, okay. There he is. <laughs> How's the experience so far? Um, it's been pretty- What's up guys, quick commercial break here. SeatGeek is an app that helps you buy tickets in the easiest way possible. You've seen me collaborate with them a lot. They've given me tickets to exclusive events. Shut the fuck up, you're lying. Yeah, it's real. No, it's not! Yeah, it's no, real. It's not! And help me buy cars for friends. Brand new car. No, you don't. Stop! If you're lying, I'm gonna kill you! Thank you, David. Yeah. But more importantly, Thank you, Seeky. <laughs> so as a friendly reminder, if you ever need to buy tickets, Seeky is the way to do it. Click the link in my description and use the promo code David for twenty dollars off your first purchase. We're drinking. We're, we're drinking. drinking. We're, we're drinking. drinking. Yeah, yeah, we're drinking alcohol. Toddy has the Jack and Heath has the tequila. We are gonna drink it and get super fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Yo, record these two. What are they about to make out? <laughs> Why do you always want to see me do sexual things? <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> do you want to go confront? David about it. He doesn't have any taste. He wouldn't know the difference between fucking water and orange juice. He's so dumb. Dude, don't talk bad about David. Oh. <laughs> Alright, should I try it? David, I asked for Pel Perrier, not Pellegrino. I think they could get- ah! oh! no! Alright, David, fine. I won't talk about the Perrier anymore. This is how I'm opening the show. And then I'm gonna go, Orange, you glad it's not a podcast? Yeah. Boo! <laughs> Two guys go into the bathroom. The one with the bigger cock stays in there and the other person comes out. So if Todd goes in with Zane, obviously Todd's cock's bigger than Zane. Zane comes out, then David goes in. I'll do it as long as I get to go against Mike first round. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't want to go first. I want to go last so I still come in second place. <laughs> By the way, the reason David wants to go first is just because he wants to see my dick. It's Fuck not about you, Mike! Fuck you! <laughs> this is a bit of Let's do our team, uh, team thing that we do in the middle. We've never done this. Don't try to hide it up. One, two, three, three, six. Right now he's coaching her on how how she has to stand next to him because he doesn't like when people are on his bad side. Jason has a bad side? It's actually the whole front side. So Jason takes pictures like this. That's the only way. You have prostitutes in your videos or no? <laughs> 